Coach, seven guys in double digits today. Talk a little bit about your balanced offensive attack. Yeah, a really good team performance. I think basketball is fun to watch when that happens, especially that first half. Uh, guys really figuring it out. The earlier question of how do you sort of incorporate Wade and how do you get Jordan Lloyd playing, and, and it was, I think, pretty special today in terms of what they were able to do, especially in the first half. Second half, our defense had to get a little bit better. We let them score too much. McCray is a talent. I think at 44 or something, I mean, heck of a basketball player. Um, but, but that said, I think a great team effort, to your point, and multiple guys stepping in. Rodney Pryor is someone who really stepped in, limited minutes. Uh, uh, someone who might not have even played today but came in and shot four for four. Awesome job by him. I know getting quick starts is always a concern, but you also talk a lot about finishing games. So what were your thoughts of the way you guys finished tonight? Yeah, both were important. My main message before we started was our start, and I thought we did a really good job. We scored the first possession. I think we might have got a stop right away and, and came out with another score. So that was really good, and you could tell they were engaged. That's important. Uh, and then maintaining that through an entire game. Again, the second half, we let them score too much, but right when it got close, we were able to gear it up again and sort of create a bit of a margin. So that, that's impressive that our starting group was able to say, hey, you know, it's time for us to win again now, and uh, they ramped up the effort, and it was good. I want to talk a little bit about your chemistry as a team. You know, you guys really celebrate each other on the bench, on the court, you move the ball. I think you had 21 assists on 28 field goals at half. Um, in the pro leagues, does that surprise you at all? And as a coach, how fun is it to see that? Yeah, this, this league is difficult. As we, we all know, there's so much turnover and so much change. But if you can create a culture of togetherness and a culture of teamwork, that's important. And that's one of the things I strive to do. And I think on a day when the when three balls are falling, it's easier for that to happen. Uh, but but a really good effort by our bench and then our, our players on the floor. We have a lot of talent now on this team. And that could be, uh, some people could say that could be difficult. But if you use it well and you sort of work it the right way, uh, you get good results like tonight. Thanks, Coach. Coach, game uh, got a little chippy out there. Obviously, some questionable calls from the referees, technical fouls assigned. Um, we want to talk about what you do to keep the composure as a team um, when, when it gets kind of chippy and aggressive out there. Yeah, a lot of time I, I, I talk a lot about energy, right? And I think we use our energy on ourselves, not on the referees. So whichever way the calls are going or whatever's happening on the other sideline, we worry about what we're doing and try and use our energy for our own positive good. And that was a message today. As the game sort of got a little bit sort of jostling around, we just say, hey, focus on us, do what we do, focus on, on our effort and our rebounding uh, and our stick hands and our gaps and our, our fundamental base, and that's what you do, and, and it was successful today. So Wade's had a couple of strong games in his first two with the team. Do you have, are you getting any pictures of how much freedom you might be allowing him uh, maybe to call plays or run his, his own sets, that type of thing, as he plays with Jordan? You have a lot of talent. If you think about how much freedom you're going to give him at all. Yeah, I mean, I think we run an open offense, uh, very similar to the Raptors, where we have triggers that initiate what we do, and then they're allowed to play, right? And we create space on the floor, and, and we, we play a lot of drive, kick, swing basketball. And I think Wade is someone who can do that very effectively, especially with other weapons on the floor with him. Uh, so if you watch, I, I don't call many, many plays. I let them figure a lot of them out. Uh, and Wade started doing that. Jordan Lloyd does that on a regular basis. So I think he's growing into our system and understanding how I coach uh, and what sort of freedoms he does have. But but listen, we're, we're an equal opportunity, open offense system. So if you get it, you can run and push. and, and uh, promotes rebounding, which is good.